the parents of a teenager who says he was kicked by a police officer while handcuffed are telling their side of the story. That officer now charged with battery. CBS 4's Mike Cuno is live at Miami-Dade Police Headquarters. Mike. Yeah, Ruta Bay, the mother and father of 17-year-old David Brown say Sergeant Gustavo de los Rios should be kicked off the force for allegedly kicking their son during, a, during an arrest back in February. I felt very hurt, very hurt. Like, I can't trust the police. The police can't be trusted. Back on February 14th, 17-year-old David Brown was pulled over, wanted for burglary. Prosecutors say cell phone video shows Officer Gustavo de los Rios kicking him after they tried to tase him and put him in handcuffs. I'm feeling very upset, angry. I mean, I want the police off the, off. I want him locked up. I want him incarcerated. I want him off the force. Prosecutors say Brown fought the police during the arrest. Although the video of the incident hasn't been released, Brown's father thinks the kick was unjustified. By him being subdued and they already had him restrained and already, you know, and, and they didn't have to do excess, excessive force once they had him already. I mean, you know, once you had him restrained, I mean, the only thing they should have did was put him in the car and transported him wherever they was going to take him. Delos Rios was charged with misdemeanor battery. Records also show he was arrested for domestic abuse after an incident with his ex-wife last year. In a similar case this year, Miami police officer Mario Figueroa was suspended with pay after video of him surfaced allegedly kicking someone in handcuffs. Figueroa is awaiting trial for assault charges. Our law enforcement, we don't look for them to do unjust things like this. I mean, you the law. You know, we, we expect that you're going to hold the law and uphold the law because you're an officer. If one of us would have did this to someone else, how, what do you think we would have been done? We would have been punished to the first degree. Now, Delo Rios has been suspended without pay. Miami-Dade police say his actions are disappointing and do not represent the agency's core values. Miami-Dade, Mike Cunio, CBS 4 News.